only want chop food, so put that one here. And your me, just put that one. Put on. They are not expensive before you start thinking. And rich kid, rich kid, is 500 naira. This way, your kelesi, egg bacon. What is going on? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. I am Kamala. And just in case you are seeing my beautiful face for the very first time, welcome, welcome, welcome. This channel is all about natural hair, skincare, lifestyle, and every other thing in between. Today's video is one of those every other thing in between. I am going to be like telling you about my experience on how I like walk by as a student and the total amount I spent. So the total amount I actually spent was nearer and i'm just going to be giving you a breakdown the reason i'm actually creating this video is as per a foodie and also i want to do like a price comparison from now when i will be uploading this video because by the time i like created this video it was in the previous administration of google and now we have like a new person in town and yes so i'm going to be doing like a comparison in the next three months to see how far and how much things cost at that particular time start off with like the dry foods and how much everything costs per se so the first thing was like indomie yes i love eating noodles although it's like not really hygienic per se per se not like it's not really hygienic it's not like good but i make sure whenever i eat my noodles i parboil it and i eat with things like maybe egg with tea just something to make myself feel good that I am not eating only starch. So make sure you try that out. Then the next thing is also oil. So one thing about this particular oil is that by the time I was in part one, it's retailed for 900 Naira. But currently it retails for 1,400 Naira. What is going on? What is going on? And also for like Indomie, the Indomie then, I remember when I was younger, a small pack of Indomie, I think it was 35 Naira, but now for you to get like a small pack of Indomie, it is 100 Naira per each one of it. And I got oh, half a carton of Indomie and that is around 2,100, meaning that a pack of Indomie now retails for 4,200 depending on where you buy it. And that 4,200 is safe is because it's Indomie tables. But if you're getting other brands, it is cheaper. So make do with that what you can get from that then the next thing is spaghetti the thing about spaghetti that really hurt me the most was that when i was in part one it was 180 but now spaghetti is 500 naira. that is really preposterous yes i'm going to be using a lot of big english that is really preposterous from 180 to 500 naira. that is actually quite ridiculous and it's actually like makes me hungry because this is something that a lot of students like i myself like it's something that when you prepare you can prepare it but spaghetti going you can prepare spaghetti with rice it just really is a very fast meal to cook so now that it's not like 500 it's quite annoying but nonetheless i got four and uh, yes i got some things for my cousin also for instance the half pack of indomie i don't eat indomie every time i can eat indomie just twice a week so 10 indomies are for our uh, 10 is for me that is why i got that a particular number then the next thing is close up i got close up for 600 naira, and i was really happy to get this close up because it was like a steal for me the close up had like a smaller tube inside of it and the last time i actually got close up that smaller tube took me like i think maybe a week plus or two weeks so that was like saving me a whole lot of money nonetheless i just made sure that i got that one then the next thing is milk i do not take milk when i'm in school so the milk is for my cousin i think it retailed for 600 or 700 i'm not so sure but the one i take is like this cowbell choco late type of i don't even know the exact name but you are going to see it on the screen so i think that one is easier for me because milk makes me sleep a lot so i do not take it while i'm in school and it also makes me use the toilet so i think i'm lactose intolerant i think i'm lactose intolerant i'm not sure and i don't want to be putting something that is not on myself so i just don't take milk when i'm in school that's all i said i take the other one and it's quite sweet it goes well with cocoa pops it goes well with when i'm taking like indomie all of that a okay, win-win for me nonetheless and i think yes cocoa pops retails for 1000 naira now and previously it used to be 500 naira per roll of a roll of 10 that's already like times two increase boo boo and immediately you will come yes but let's just see oh, this new man that is in town you cannot say if things will be good or things will be your kelesi egg bacon we cannot say meaning that we don't know if things will go down south but we're hoping that it is for the best hopefully but we can see like two weeks in and things are already like really expensive for instance fuel went from 
187 to 500 and 500 is the minimum you can see some states is 540 550 so if this is happening just two weeks in i really wonder what will happen one month two months three months in i'm just going to make sure i do an update video to this actually and also i got this video i have there from olukunle itsuno she's a youtuber here on youtube also i just got this video idea and i was like i must do it and since my friend also encouraged me thank you please that i should do this video idea i decided i'm going to shoot it before i take down my braids then the next thing is burger like peanuts burger i really love like taking peanuts burger when i'm in school and i don't even take it with gary i just like to eat it like that period although it makes me break out but who that won't help we'll see it nonetheless then the next thing is i got like sugar i previously got like the one liter sugar which i am still using i don't know who sent me to go and buy another like 0.5 kg of or half of a liter type of sugar again i thought that one liter would have finished but i'm still using it so that is that but the sugar retails for the one the current size i bought retails for 500 while the one liter one that i bought was 1000 and that 1000 naira one was i think previously around 500 or even less than that but you know like baking items are so expensive and dangote items are already like really expensive the man has to get his money back sure you get so it's with the masses that don't let me say that we are suffering but we're not suffering in jesus name then the next thing is chocolate i usually like to get like six chocolate bars they are not expensive before you start thinking and rich kid rich kid rich kid no the chocolate retails for i think for 100 naira. i like to get six and there are two particular brands i like to get but the day i went to go shop the woman only had just one so i just bought that one Hold on. yes i also got biscuits i noticed getting like half I, I noticed getting a dozen of biscuits pays me more than having to buy snacks every day snacks every day is like 100 naira, and sometimes i might not be full so i might have to spend 200 naira. But it pays me to get like half a dozen of like it pays me to get a dozen of biscuits which is 600 for 12 and to also get like a roll of peanuts burger which is i think 12 or 10 in a row so when i'm going out i just take one biscuit and one peanut burger and i'm good to go sure you get you can also implement this it works so well for me and the person i buy for she allows you to mix like variety of biscuits the ones with butter the one without butter crackers digestive oh all those really nice sweet brands that i'm sure you also eat she allows you to mix it up then for the wet food i got pepper that day i was really pissed when i came back from the market because of this pepper we bought pepper from a normal person in your me I bought pepper for her, 500. I'll show you on the screen the one she sold for me for 500. While well, I now went to another person. This other person now sold pepper for me, 200. And the pepper of 200 was looking like the pepper I bought for 500. I was so confused, but I cannot go and be fighting someone. So I just had to carry my pepper and be going like that. Also bought potato. The only thing that she did for me was to sell potato well for me. And the potato I got for 200. I think it is around 6 or 7. I got for 200. So that was a steal. But currently, yo. The new update in town, the woman does not sell 200 naira potato again. Potato is now 500, 1000 naira. Almost like yam. Kilagwe kilaju. The next thing I also got is iru because that day I wanted to like make a four. I had not eaten a four in a long time and I was craving eba. Weirdly, I was craving eba. I even created, I even ate eba that afternoon or so. The next day, maybe in the afternoon, I ate eba as my afternoon food. Very weird, but I was really craving it. I also got like a four two hundred before a four when I was in part one. A four was like around. See the girl the way she's walking, dragging her feet. Nonsense. So previously, F4 used to be like 50 naira, 100 naira, but currently you cannot see anything significant for a vegetable for 50 naira, 100 naira. The one that you see that is going to make sense, that can last you at least two days, is 200 naira. So I just got that. I got onions also. I also got onions at a good deal, 300 for I think maybe 10. So that was a very, very good one. Then I bought chicken, chicken for 860 naira. I know you are wondering how I was able to get it for 860. So where I currently buy like my frozen food from, like the chicken, they do this thing whereby they have cut down already. So they like, might cut the chicken into two or cut it into four. So it is per way, per the weight of the chicken. So if they weigh something and it's 900, that's what you pay based on your budget. If they wear another one that is heavier and it's 1,000, that's what you pay. But that particular day, the one I chose was 860. So, period. It paid me and it paid me than having to go and buy meat. Because if you see the meat, they are selling for 500 naira. Yeah. Could you, car, what me buy? 
skinkly like this small like this five so i just decided that chicken was one that paid me and i also got pomo for 215 era something weird happened like two weeks ago when i wanted to go and buy pomo and the woman was telling me that pomo is 600 i was like it cannot be me that will buy pomo that doesn't have nutritional benefits for 600 i carried my luggages i went to go and buy fish instead one thing i also say is that if you want to like experiment with your like toppings you can do like a week pomo fish another week for more egg another week chicken for more you can just mix things up because if you only buy for more you might get bored of it but if you're having something else your stew will be attractive to yourself sure you get me so for the dry food everything costs ten thousand three hundred and fifteen naira. while for the frozen like wet food everything costs two thousand four hundred and nineteen naira. and i also took bike that day of 180 usually bike was 15 naira before but that day, the person I saw did not have change. So I had to pay 18 naira. And because of my load was also plenty, I now had to pay 100 naira when I was going back to my hostel. Was I annoyed? Yes. But I had to still pay the money because Nami won't chop food. So that was just how I got the entire price of 12,840 naira. So in the next three months, I'm going to do a comparison of all these prices. And let's just hope that it is cheaper then but if it is not cheaper i'm going to let you know of course i'm going to let you know i'm going to let you know on all the tea and also one thing is that recently i bought gas when i was about one gas was 250 per kg the previous time i got gas it was 850 but luckily it seems there has been a decline so now gas now retails for 700 naira per kg i'm hoping it it's like reduces more but let's just see how it goes that's just all on today's video yes i really wanted to do this video and i'm glad i did it yeah period i'm glad i did it and i know you will enjoy it by god's grace in jesus name if you are yet to subscribe please enjoy to subscribe it is completely totally free welcome to the family subscribe for more updates and ensure you also check out my previous videos i have vlogs i have unboxing i have like podcast episode with my friends and i cannot even wait to do like the season two for you guys but i'm almost done with season one i have other videos that i'm sure you like really will like i also have like a skincare sunday where i share product recommendations my skincare routine i share like tryouts of new skincare products everything so if you want your skin to look like mine or even better ensure you watch like the playlist i'm going to link down below and that's all on today's video i will see you in my next one bye guys